The 6 a.m. practices are over for the football players at Lackawanna College. It's now scrimmage time for the high-flying Falcons as they prepare for the 2023 season. It's fantastic. A lot of people in the country are doing 6 a.m. workouts now with their players for a number of reasons. One, academically, you miss no classes. So even if you have a, a trip or someplace you go, the classes are scheduled later on. And then secondly, you know, there's, they're tired at night. They go to sleep kind of early and wake up. We get our practice done before school ever begins. You just have to put the work in. Everything is not given here, but if you put the work in, you will succeed. 6 a.m. practices, what did you like most about those? Getting after it. The physicality, you, you, you're up in the morning, you're fresh, you're ready to go. So it's just, it's, it's great, it's great, great energy. Harper is a mainstay at linebacker and controls the defense, while Therese Worthy, the All-American tailback, should get plenty of carries for this offense. I want us all to be together, so like, where I go out there and make a play, and then, you know, we got our receivers making plays. I just want to, you know, quit, like, I feel like I just want to be a part of this, this offense. Well, this is the 30th year for Mark Duda as the head coach here of Lackawanna College, and he sits on 199 career wins. He can go for that 200th career win here Saturday, September 2nd, when Lackawanna College has their first home college football game here at Scranton High School. When I started this, I was hoping to get one win. <laughs> you know, now it's a lot different. Lackawanna finished 7-3 in 2022 and a final NJCAA ranking of 13th in the country. Be part of it. Be part of it. There we go. There we go. 